fellow explorers. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. This week we are at Luna White Deer Campground. It is a national forest campground. As such, half the sites are usually reservable and half for first come first serve. So we are just hoping to find a good first come first serve site. Campground is in between two beautiful lakes. Can you guess their names? You got it! Luna Lake and White Deer Lake. Good guess. Oh. <laughs> uh, be nuts. We've never been to this campground before, so looking forward to checking it out and seeing what it has, what it doesn't have. But like I said, it's a national forest campground, so it ain't gonna have any amenities. It's got garbage cans. Well, got garbage cans. <laughs> that is view. Yeah, it's got the woods. That's the only amenity I want. I thought I was your amenity. <laughs> the beautiful north woods. So you guys can come along and help us pick out a site. In 1,000 feet, uh, turn oh, left yeah. to stay on Forest Road 2188. Campground straight up. Straight up to the campground. Right dearly. Exactly. And there's a uh, hiking trail that goes around both lakes, which we will be doing. Yeah. Taking you with us. Welcome to Luna White Deer. Okay, let's get an envelope. Okay, let's go find a site. Which one do you want to go through first? One through nine? Yeah, sure. We'll start at the beginning. There's one way. There's one, reservable. Oh, this one kind of sucks too. Oh, is it? Three. Three. That's pretty nice. Four. That's the one I had to do. Oh, you did. This is one I canceled. Did I name on it? Um, probably somebody else got it by now. Yeah, that's the one. This one has, I don't see an R on this one. So keep that one in mind, number five. That's pretty nice. Eight's a pretty nice one. We'll do the second loop and then we'll make our choice. Well, so far it's looking pretty empty, so that's good. Okay. So you get boat landings that way. Yep. Luna Lake is that way. Okay. Well, I was a kid, I always thought they came up and closed the gates at 10 o'clock. <laughs> okay. Number Two, 10. Mm -hmm. Too bad. Number 11. Kind of like that one. Yeah. Oh, you can see the, no, you can see the lake. The lake is pretty swampy here. Yeah, it's over a bite. Number 12, that's reservable. Oh, I see his white signs in here. I think the number 14 one looks very nice. Yeah, that's nice, definitely. It's a trail, but... Nice. Ooh, I like this one up on the hill. 17. Ooh, can we stop and check it out? See what's level enough. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's nice, great big level area right up there. Yeah, keep it in mind. Yeah. You want to stop now? I'd say take this one. It's really nice. All right. What number is it? Seventeen, I think it is. 
There's not red band? No red band and no R. Okay, just turn it that way a little bit. Looks good. Looks level too. Suckers all over. Yeah, lots of skeeters. Oh, these mosquitoes, holy shit. Tell me about it. Oh, wow, I've never seen so many mosquitoes. Yeah. Well, guys, as nice it, as it was, Luna Lake White Deer Lake Campground was totally overrun by mosquitoes. Important mosquitoes. Uh, yeah, jeez. Yeah, I don't see no point in camping when all you can do is sit inside to get away from the mosquitoes. <laughs> kind of defeating the purpose. So we might be just just taking a ride today. Is that what you're saying? Because <laughs> I know when I got out there, that my whole shoulder was covered. Yeah, they are just. We just follow, follow Google. <laughs> well, we gotta drive till we get. <laughs> we gotta drive till we get somewhere. <laughs> till we get some internet. <laughs> oh. You didn't bring your maps, did ya? Maps? No maps. No. Nope. I have maps. You go and get it shortly. <laughs> Yeah, they were biting me like crazy, so you know they're bad, because usually they don't bother me that much. Yeah. They were biting me until I got a spray going. When they get to a point where they're that bad, that spray doesn't even help. Yeah. So I smacked them. <laughs> yeah, that's a turkey. That's a damn turkey running down the road. Scared, you don't know which way to go, or she. So we're gonna have to see if we can come up with a plan B. But it's only it was gonna be an overnighter, so we only have so much time to come up with a plan B. I'm such a good move. I even gonna leave you pay for lunch. You are. Now that's really nice to let me pay for lunch. Ain't that? You're just the sweetest I'm ever. A gentleman. <laughs> I don't know that's seventy or not. Do you? Yeah, it is. Well, we're gonna run in and get some food. That yeah, would be that way, right? Yeah. I'm hungry. Okay, we'll go in, have lunch, and think about things. Go into town, Eagle River, have lunch. Have to do a day trip overlanding adventure 